Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video today, we'll be, di we'll be discussing the pros and cons of transitioning to tech slacks hair. Um, I'll be going through five pros and cons. So let's start off with the pros, of course. The main pro, of course, um, the main pro that you will get while you transition to text like hair, text like hair is, of course, your hair, your hair will become thicker. You, the, the volume that you will get in your hair will be unbelievable, guys. Trust me, it will be so much thicker than when your hair is bone straight. And the next very important pro, um, pro to me also is that I think my hair is in a healthier state when it's text lax instead of being relaxed bone straight. Reason being is that you're not applying the chemical to your hair to the point where it's destroying all the protein bonds in your hair. You're not getting your hair that bone bone straight so you're leaving some texture. So I think in that sense you would tend to have a little bit more protein bonds left back in your new growth. So those are the two main pros. In terms of cons no guys, the first con that I'll tell you guys to be mindful of is that your hair will get tangled and matted very very easily. And when I'm um in a when my hair is in a position where I am a lot of weeks post, probably like eight weeks go go upward, I tend to find that my hair gets tangled very easy and on wash days it tends to take me a lot longer to tangle my hair before I'm able to wash it so sometimes it takes me like probably like an hour and a half to detangle my hair in sections fully before um before I'm um, washing my hair so that's a pro that you guys have to keep in in mind also another pro um another not pro I mean guys another con to keep um to be mindful of is that when you um if you live in a humid a very humid um climate when you flat iron your hair your hair poofs up in no time for instance i'm in jamaica right now and i flat ironed my hair once over the summer and in like an hour or two my hair was in a big poof ball guys i'm dead serious it was so poofy so that's one other um fact that you have to take in consideration your hair will poof up and get big very easy especially if you live in a very hot um climate and the last con is that your straight ends will annoy the living hell out of you and they will look thinner and thinner as your hair as your text like hair is coming um coming in it tends to look thinner and thinner and they will irritate the living hell out of you some days you're gonna feel like you would just snip them like how I'm feeling right now <laughs> yeah I have days when I feel like I would just cut all the relaxed ends off seriously guys they annoy me so much but you know you have to um be patient and um be patient and learn to bear through it a little bit like how I'm doing now I'm almost hitting the one year um one year post of being at, um text lax it's, it's gonna be next month in October and I'm currently let me see, I'm currently 14 weeks post relaxer and it's a struggle guys, trust me. Especially since my hair grows a lot um, faster in the summer, my hair is just like a big poof bond mess. Look at the root, it's just really really thick and a big poof ball guys. So yeah, and the reason why I'm stretching so long this time, I'm stretching to 16, it's going to be 16 and, a, 16 and a half weeks when I get my um relax my um fresh text lax and my reason for doing that is that my birthday is next month october 12th so i decided to just wait it out a little bit instead of relaxing my hair and then when my birthday come i don't have a, like a fresh look so i decided to just wait it out so yeah so those are all uh, my pros and cons of transition is the text lax hair i hope this video was helpful to you guys should you have any questions or concerns, leave it down in the bottom bar as usual. And of course, I'll come back to you guys in about two and a half weeks time when I get my fresh text locks to do like a hair update. So that's it for this video guys. Thanks, thanks for watching. Bye.